Hi, this is just a quick demo of the latest HS Touch design I've done for my mobile phone. Unlike my wall-mounted tablets, the real estate on this is much smaller, um, so I want it to be designed to be nice and easy to see and, and functional. So in the top left-hand corner, you'll see I've created a hamburger menu similar to a lot of our other apps. You can click that, it will give you menus to take you through to the various different screens, but I've also created sub-menus underneath that. So for example, in here, uh, under cameras, I can select that and then choose which of the cameras I want to go to. So in this case, I might choose the pool area. That'll load up the screen from there. Um, because of the fact that if I left that running in the background, it will continue to stream that feed, I've designed it so that when you press the hamburger menu, it'll change that image back to the text for that image back to a blank page so it doesn't continue doing it. Um, the actual design is fairly straightforward, so if I want to turn on a, a device or a room, I can. The room I'm in is a study, so I could turn that off, turns the lights off, press it, can come back on again. I didn't bother with the multi-level ones, I've just toggled it on and off. Um, I may play around with a view for uh, multi-level switches later on. Um, different menus, same thing again for appliances. thermostats. I've just taken a little version of uh, what I've had on my wall mounted tablet in the past and chucked that on there. Security. So with the security page you'll notice that the, the images and text goes off the bottom. So what I've done is to make this page scrollable kind of like a normal Android app I've increased the size of this particular screen greater than the project size. And this enables me to scroll up and down to see all the various items. Power usage. Just use the uh, graphing capability. I'm not so happy with that, but it works. Weather based information. Using the information gathered from Weather XML plus my own weather station. And then location based devices. 